hello guys welcome back to my channel please don't don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more content like this okay um now we are going to talk about binance liquid farming liquid farming is all about staking your coin against another coin to earn pool rewards okay so um to move ahead what do we do you come to more that more section is where you see every fixture that is on Binance. Okay, now scroll down and we'll go to this is trade, this is gift and campaign, this is trade, this is N. Okay, when you come to N, you come to liquidity farming. That's liquid farming. You tap on it. So we allow it to load. We allow it to load okay this is it guys as you can see there are different kinds of pools here we have at at bet that's um 6.7 percent we have uh, btc usdt we have bnb8 you need to have this sense means that you need to have btc and usdt in your wallet this bnb8 this BNB ETH means that you need to have BNB and ETH in your wallet. Like um, the highest pool here is is twenty percent Monero and USDT. That means you need to have both Monero and USDT in your wallet. Um, this thirteen thirteen percent Monero ETH you need to have both Monero and ETH in your wallet. Okay, that is the meaning of it, and you need to have them equal. If you are staking Monero and ETH, you need to have ten dollar worth of ETH and ten dollar worth of Monero that is the only way it can work okay this is liquid farming so but what we have in our wallet is five so i will search click on file we type file in the search bar type file and we wait for it to load okay guys so this is um this is file liquidities these are the pools that you find in file file Fi does not have it doesn't have any it doesn't have much percentage yield in it. This is a one point um, this one um five B USD is one point five, five USD is one point four, five BTC is one point five, five BMB is one point seven. So file is not interesting guys, but there's there's nothing we can do. We have five, so and we are going I'm going with five B USD. It looks like Yes, I'm going with 5B USD. You tap on it and then you click on liquidity. Liquidity. It's coming up. Okay. So when it come out like this, we are waiting for it to load well. Okay, it has loaded well now. So our five balance have shown this is our five balance. 31 file available uh, so now we have we have um we have the we have different ways of staking it we have five plus five plus busd we have only five we have only busd if you want to stake all these ones if you want to stake it like that the first one is five plus busd that means you need to have um five coin worth of and 92 dollar uh, we have uh, our five coin is 31 it is worth 92 dollar then we, we need to have bus the worth 92 dollar for us to use the first option now the second one which is add file that means we are staking file alone okay the third one bus that means we are staking busd alone but all of them are inside five coin liquidity pool okay everything is just to provide liquidity for file because people are making use of it so they need liquidity so we are providing liquidity for them inside Filecoin pool. Now, if we are using the first one, which is Filecoin plus BUSD, the fee is zero zero percent fee. But if you are, let's tap five because we have only five. Uh, only five. Okay. There's only five. So click on maximum. We are staking all. Let's tap on maximum. The maximum have appeared now you click on you agree the terms impermanent there are, there are something called impermanent loss 
there is no problem we are we are already in the we are already in the beer market so we can afford to be at the impermanent loss impermanent loss means when the price of fire continues to go down okay it will still be going down even though it was staked so it does not matter whether it is staked or not it will still the, the price the volume will still be going down if it is going up it is going up okay but the goal is for us to get um for the file card not to be staying in our wallet and be doing nothing it has to be working so now click on add liquidity click on add liquidity they say providing liquidity with file a single token will swap part of file into busd according to the current pool size and swap price your initial uh, initial portion of pool will be file and busd the number of the two tokens will change in real time based on the latest price pool so once we click on ok now binance on their own they will use their hand to divide the filecoin we have and busd they will divide the filecoin into two part of it will go to busd part of it will go to file but anytime you want to remove the liquidity anytime you want to take back your coin all of them will still come back as file okay so we click on ok so our coin is staked I'm still trying to load okay add successfully so we have added our our file and be usd now so that is how to do it guys <clears throat> you can click on view my portion to view to view um to view your staked file how it is okay you see my total portion total earnings the unclaimed rewards remember that you always come here to claim your rewards so total earnings 0.05 ua 0.05 usd already so um, with time with time uh, what as in with time what we should earn will be coming down for us you now come and you click you always you click on claim all okay click here claim to claim the ones you have you have already found but it's not compulsory that you must be coming every time you can come in from time to time to do that okay now anytime you want to remove liquidity you stick you stick do the same thing this liquidity click on liquidity now you look at this place look here remove you click on remove okay i don't know why it's not going but anytime you want to remove liquidity that is where you click you click on remove liquidity okay it's not removing because okay uh, you do not have any liquidity swap portion to remove so nothing has been added for now so we have to wait until we have any reward before we can remove that's what they are trying to say but already we have if we want to remove now i can click on maximum and remove everything but i don't want to remove my liquidity for now so that is it guys that's how to do it so at your own time you can play around with it stake your coin don't allow your, your coin should not be in your wallet doing nothing okay it has to be working thank you guys please don't forget to subscribe